heard. A group of South Florida lawmakers traveled to the Keys today to save what they call the jewel of the ocean. Aquarius, an undersea research lab, has lost its funding and is in danger of closing. Now, as CBS 4's Joan Murray reports, the push is on to raise money privately to save Aquarius. With full tanks of air, this group of South Florida lawmakers is getting ready to go down under to raise awareness. What a shame that this uh, very little cost operation now has lost all of its funding. She's talking about Aquarius, the world's only undersea research lab, three miles off Key Largo, 60 feet below the surface. Besides scuba gear, this group is heading out with a lot of uncertainty because Aquarius's future is very much in jeopardy and efforts are underway to keep it afloat. Aquarius has lost federal funding. A foundation has been started to transition the reef base to a private facility. So it's a $3 million program, a drop in the bucket compared to some of the other big programs, oceanographic programs in existence. Through webcams, we watch the last researchers of the year suit up, leave Aquarius, and ascend to the surface. Then the South Florida lawmakers took their place and made their case. Uh, we're, uh, we're hoping that folks who are seeing us right now will uh, go to the website of AquariusReefBase.org and uh, contribute so that we can uh, keep this uh, incredible uh, underwater research lab going for generations to come. When you're dealing with all of the different issues that our reefs and our oceans are dealing with now, whether it's acidity, whether it's temperature, whether it's pollutants, it's very difficult to be able to monitor everything all the time. Well, here, they can do it. But time is running out, and the race is on to save Aquarius, a national treasure researchers say we cannot afford to lose. In Key Largo, Joan Murray, CBS 4 News.